Hey y'all, I am, my name's Say. I'm a senior at Brookston, and I'm so glad that I get to talk to y'all today, even if it is through a video. So, when I was growing up, my family went to church some, and I knew who God was, but I really didn't know what it would look like to have a relationship with Him, or really even knew that, that was like a thing that people did. Um, God was completely a Sunday thing, like a church thing, and that was it. Um, but when I was in seventh grade, I had the opportunity to go to Southwind, which was amazing, and y'all should all go. And that was really the first time I ever got the chance to hear about what a relationship with Jesus would look like and how that would affect my life. Um, and even though this is when I accepted Jesus and it was the best decision I've ever made to this day, I don't consider this necessarily to be my testimony with the Lord, which is kind of weird, so let me explain. Um, so my testimony with the Lord is that through everything, He was always there, even when I didn't feel like it. Um, between my first year of middle school and this year, senior year, every part of my life has changed so much. Um, through all the drama with my friends, through every argument with my parents, through all the things I've stressed over, classes, tests, anything, um... God was always there, and he's been the only constant thing in my life um, through the big and the small things. And I know that right now is a really weird time, and that I know that y'all just want to get out of your house and see your friends and go back to normal life, because I get it. I completely feel you. I agree with you 100%. Um, and I think during times like these, it's really easy to ask the question, where is God? Like, I'm in quarantine at 15, and I'm bored, and I want to get out, and where is God? And there's so many unknowns, which can put a little bit of fear in our brains. Um, and But I want y'all to know that I believe with my whole heart that God is the same yesterday, today, and forever, and that if you seek out the Lord, you will find Him. Um, so with that, I challenge y'all to look for God in just one part of your day. It can be the smallest thing ever, like just anything. Um, and I get it. If y'all's day looks anything like mine, it's probably pretty boring. You don't do much. But I do believe that even in the most uneventful day, the Lord is working in our lives. Um, so I'm going to pray and then we'll be done. Lord, thank you so much for who you are and that you are always here. Lord, I pray for these middle schoolers, and I just thank you for being here for us. I pray that they will seek and find you in just some part of their day, Lord. Lord, we love you and praise you every day. Amen.